Hey everyone, this is James Loves Christian Stuff. For this video, <clears throat> I'm going to do a VHS, DVD, Blu-ray, and software update for October 22nd, 2023. So I'm going to show you one VHS tape, three DVDs, technically four because one of them is a two DVD set or something. One Blu-ray and one software. So it's, here's the one and only VHS I have. This is my third all grown up tape I have. The other one I have being of Lucky 13 and All Grown Up. So I don't know the actual title. But this is my third all grown up tape. And I remember seeing this on a DVD of Nick Picks 2, 2005 DVD. This is the only episode Interview with a Campfire. Print date right here. Print date is the 11th week of 2005. Now here are the three DVDs. I remember watching Reading Rainbow when I was a kid. And this was one of the episodes I remember. Came with an insert, so I'll show you right after I show you this. And there's the discussion points. I do not like, um, I hate Daniel Tiger's Neighborhood. Mostly neutral to Dinosaur Train. I only like Caillou and Arthur. And I don't care for Super White or Peep in the Big White World. I used to watch that, but not anymore. And I don't like uh, Peg and Cat either. Or Wild Kratts. Again, I just like Arthur and Caillou. I now have all of the Brady Bunch DVDs, so I just needed this to complete. I like this hologram thing. That right there was the final episode. The series finale of the Brady Bunch. And there's also um, the Brady Bunch movie, which I know is on VHS and DVD, maybe even Blu-ray. And there's a sequel, a very brave sequel, which I might get those soon. I wanna get them on VHS one of these days. There's also the Brady Bunch uh, volumes on VHS of the TV series, which I know Fabian's Media Corn 2001 has those tapes, along with 
the Brady Bunch movie and a very Brady sequel. This is the sequel to The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe, which I do have both copies on DVD. One being the theatrical release, two-disc set, and another one being a 47th the extended cut. This is a 2008 DVD. Here's disc one, which is the, the movie. And here's disc two, which are the bonus features. And the digital copy, disc three. I do have National Treasure 2 Book of Seeds on DVD. I have National Treasure on VHS. I think I have all the Pirates of the Caribbean movies. And I, I do have Cars on VHS. I have the first Narnia movie on DVD. Two, two copies, like I said. I have Meet the Robinsons on Blu-ray. This, this sweepstakes started on October 1st, 2008 and ended on January 31st, 2009. Here's the code for Chronicles of Narnia Prince Caspian. which This one expired on December 2nd, 2009. Now here's the Blu-ray. One of these days I'm going to give this movie a watch sometime. It sounds really good. Oh, this one is in stack. Okay, this one's a DVD, and this one is the Blu-ray. And here's the code for it, which I'm not really sure when this one expires, but who cares? Disney Movie Club. The one I showed you for Prince Cast Me now is Disney Movie Rewards. I think they changed it to Movie Club. Last but not least, the one and only software. I haven't been collecting any Jumpstart softwares in a while. I remember having this when it was a three disc set with music and art club. I actually do have Jumpstart music that is separate. Now, I would say that this is the end of the update video. Well, it actually isn't. <sighs> because I have something to show you. It's a book. This is uh, Trump in the White House 2017 through 2021, The Divider. This is what I got uh, tonight. Or today, shall I say. So this mostly tells us story of Donald Trump when he was president of the White House. Now, I know there are most of you that uh, don't like Donald Trump, but to any of you that don't, I respect your opinion.
but make sure you respect mine. And also, um, for my Try Not To Laugh challenge of my main channel, James Norton, I said, the video is dedicated to Ali Jessa 2000 and Michael Reffens, or Mike Lenz on Facebook. I'm mostly for Ali Jessa 2000, and um, let me just say that I'm neutral to him nowadays. Just as long as he has nice comments for me. Ali Jessa, if you're watching this, just know that it's been fun watching you for eight years, but I feel think it's time we went our separate w w ways and I wish all luck to you in the future same to you Michael Ruffins and for the rest of the rest of you guys um I'm still going to uh like YouTubers that I like like Fabian's Media Corner 2001 David Knucky or DK's Media Central Returns um uh Tara Bus Mustafa's Movie Corner and lots of other YouTubers as well. And there will be more update videos to come in the future. Because I have some more stuff coming in. So stay tuned. Other than that, you all have a great week. And take care. This is James Loves Christian Stuff signing out.